I have to give the edge to the point because mechanically they seem so far ahead after what we seen in the first game. But Team Obos is rough. If they manage to to execute it properly, it could be scary. It could really be scary, especially if Pain was able to get the farm that he needs. You know, maybe the first or the second Amazing. item, and of course with his packs on this side as well. Meantime, that was a really fast clear, having four members on the side of Team Obos. Clear that minion waves in the mid. What is happening on to the bot side with just ML successfully clearing and cutting off the minion waves in that area of the map? Hmm. Well, I'm still gonna be watching Liu here. I want to see how she recovers from a game like that. I feel that... Yeah, from that team. Mm-hmm, because ML is as much of a mental game as any other team game, so... If you manage to get it... Yeah, as I was saying, Liu is definitely gonna be a point of interest for both teams right now because like, if you're an opposing member, like if Liu is on the enemy team and you know she just had such a bad game, you will try to abuse that and try to make her tilt even more. That is for sure, but I... Yeah, I can see rotation ongoing on to the top side right now. But uh, that was YOLO getting really aware of the map. Oh, I don't see the members on the bot side or rather in the mid side anymore. It seems like they're going to be rotating towards the top. So I have to tower hug and back away. And it seems like it's a, it's a mirror. It's a mirror rotation ongoing because we saw a while ago three to four members roaming around the bot side as well, planning to gank uh, Chooks TV, Bisakol, that... Uh, uh, on the bot side as well. Let's see if this is gonna happen because Lou, as well as Coach Chalk, is in here. Lou is super low in HP, getting sun out. Chalk, no, oh, will he be the first casualty? But no, it is actually the Hylos. Coach Chalk will be the very first one. And that kill actually went onto the hands of Chantel, the Kagura. And again, I'm gonna be highlighting that over and over because, you know, that what made Team Lupon won their first series on the first day of the Creator Games Battle of Heroes. I mean, when you're Kagura and a player like Chantel, who you, who you said time and time again, loves that hero, he even runs flame shot with it, so... He gets that momentum. Could basically just be a core as well, right? Competitive level think, of play. Mm -hmm. Okay, they're, they're posturing for the turtle here. Coach Shock is gonna see them out. The rock block is gonna be there. But no fight, no go for both teams. Aldo, though, I feel like they're, he, he's feeling the pressure right now. Yes, he has high le a higher level than Sergius, but mid lane pain, Blazing Duet is gonna be there, but it just kickles in this early stage. Not gonna be painful, mm -hmm. it's a Blazing Tickle. Unfortunately, damage this damage is well, we can see Bot an ultimate though. ongoing Aldo? onto the bot Going side the Ooh. Yeah. He, he didn't want to Cancel go for no, it, he felt I, that he just, wanna... he just wanted to yeah, go back he... to the lane pseudo, pseudo teleport as they like to call it a drama it's caught between two heroes here falling a bit low is the, is the killing blow gonna be there? not quite nicely done by Joma with the wild charge to get away. Mm -hmm. And as oh, you can see, position the in the map already on the turtle. They're, will they start in? No, they want to go for Zeus meantime, but Ultimate is already committed in here by that Hyla. Zeus having some trouble in here will, will be the first oh. casualty, but no, look at that! Kagura will still get a kill Chantel! And Zeus just basically poking the hell of the members of Team Obos right now. Meanwhile, on to the top side, you can see a 1v1 ongoing. Well, there's an action ongoing 4v4 on the bot side as well. Really good pressure being put down by Team Lupon. Again, 3-0 Chantel. 3-0 wow. Chantel. Really good micro Chantel. plays. Ate mo Chantel. <laughs> Kagura isn't the easiest of heroes, by the way, so even more respect 
person tells just be able to pull off plays like that. Like I thought, like he was she was ready a while ago also. He saw that pain left the BMI, so mm-hmm. Chantel just waited around his BMI. Just, just you know, just the 200 IK play from Chantel there. I don't oh, care I if you used to be a pro player. IK. I can run with you. Showed. You go, girl, oh, as sure. they like to say. Chuck Noodle, yeah, meantime, oh, though, that was a fail invade by Chuck Nu on that blue buff. He ended up dying onto the hands of Pain, giving Pain the much needed kill that he wants for him to go online. They gotta wait for this uh, clot. But you know what? Although we saw that three kills already onto the hands of Pain, I think if Kim Lupon prolongs this fight or prolongs this match, later on, they're gonna see. Pain just going wild with, with his blazing duet. Yeah. I mean, where he got the damage that he needs. For sure. And look at that. Another casual team here on the side of Team Lepon are going to be chasing down Zook. Seems like yes, they're going to be going too deep just to secure the skill. But first goes the kick. Then again, though, a one for one trade because of that really deep overextension. Meanwhile, I'll do this to call TV going for the tier one third on the bot side. Well, an action is another another action is ongoing onto the top side as well. And in me and YOLO are really good cut of waves in there, creating some space for the minion waves on the top side to even go for a push on. Uh, that tier one. Meanwhile, Pain is gonna get one kill. Joma trying to back away, getting slowed down. I don't think he will be able to make it out. No, he won't. Double kill onto the hands of Pain. Perfect usage of Art of Saver to just stay on top of Joma and Pain. He's not gonna stop. He's gonna be knocked up here. Nice BMI at the last second, but he will still fall. Zeus was ready for him. Do they still want to go for more Chakumis over there by the river? Won't go for the re-engage. And that will be hmm. that. Just the lone kill onto Pain place. But I, I mean, Pain, Pain is really forced to try and make plays here because he knows he's ahead. So he has to take advantage. So, as you have seen here, this is not the kind of pressure that Tim Lupon can do a while ago in game one compared to what we can see in game 2 maybe because they don't have the clone anymore on their side and they're just gonna be they just have to rely on the on the space that was created for them but they're having a hard time to do so again in terms of taking objectives they do not have a marksman on their side um they, they will soon. basically just rely on the damage coming from Chantel and of course Jack Nu as well even um yeah, they gotta be careful on on pain on this one. This, this is now a pain with a 3-2 score. It's gonna be a 4-2 even right after they kill that Kagura on the mid lane. But that was a space created for Team Lupon to take that turtle of the game. Meanwhile, Jacknu will be securing the 2 buff. Joma though, having a hard time in trying to map away because he is getting slowed down a lot by the members of Team Ubos. And of course, Pain will get a kill. Sir Zeus has to be able to find Pain with this combo. Oh, just deleted was the joy at YOLO, and they're gonna get more. They're gonna get Chakmu as well. Two down. Chantel, can you have the return here? Do you have the damage? No, you will fall to the grave as well. Mega kill now on to Pain Flakes, and yeah, it was just. We did say that the draft of a boss was really good with the Claude as well as the Thams. Just very easy for them to execute. Mm -hmm. And Lupon, just a bit of overconfidence, I guess. Is this them banning the Layla, biting them in the back? <laughs> right. Or I, I think so too. Maybe they have finally, oh, we should have not banned Layla. The team of boss was able to. Uh, pick Claude because of that. We were a little bit cocky by picking that one out. And uh, speaking of objectives, you can see that Team Ubois will be taking down the third 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 on the top side. But meanwhile, oh, getting locked down. Well, that Valir Lu won't be able to make an escape BMI. And of course, the Blazing Do it going in. Oh, Pain will get more skills. And of course, together with that is Animi on the side of Team Ubos. Peter's left for the side of Lupon right now. Again, 
they do not have a marksman, thus they are also having a hard time in terms of taking objectives. Look how, how I head pain is. He's level 14. Chakro is the highest level on the enemy side. He's level 12. Is that Will be way of the dragon there. The follow up is definitely gonna be there, and they're just gonna shut down that Aldo. It's gonna be first, first death. Lord is up. Oh. Will they take advantage? No, Glorious pathway has been committed here, but they have created the space to reduce. Very slippery onto that show. Yes, yeah, slippery enough to graze the distance, but right on top of him is gonna be pain. Let's see, Blazing Duet is still available if they go for it. There we go. Over the backline, BMI forward, but Lance did pick up the kill. Chakno on a sliver of health, won't run away from that. He will be shut down as well. YOLO is going to be run down by the rest of his team, and it is now just Joma, the lone survival, survivor for Team Lupon. What can you do against for? I, I die, think I they can put an energy on. I think he's gonna die. die. He's gonna die. And they got a minion waves. I think Team Oboss got this. 